submitted for your approval. Four people going out for an average dinner on an average night in an average city. Little do they know that a combination of dim light, small font, and aging eyes will conspire against them. But they are about to be taken to a frightful place, a dimension where even the simplest of tasks will prove impossible and cause utter humiliation. A dimension where the truth is right in front of your face, but you can't read it. A dimension where the closer you get, the less you see. They are about to enter the Presbyopia Zone. Meet Kathy. Beautiful, attractive. She's already had LASIK surgery. Running behind schedule, she decides to touch up her makeup at the table. Yet it's not as simple as it seems. She still turns heads, but tonight, not necessarily for the right reasons. You look beautiful, sweetie. Let me introduce Robert, who previously had cataract surgery. He once was a naval pilot who had eyes like a hawk. Too stubborn to bring his reading glasses with him tonight, he's now flying blind. Kathy, honey, could I borrow your glasses, please? Thank you, sweetie. What? Meet Emily, an amatrope who can't quite make out the fancy cursive on the menu. The server is waiting and the pressure's on. <clears throat> she decides to take a gamble, stating, I'll just have your special. Finally, we meet Dennis. In his early 50s, he's your typical emetrope. Normally a resourceful and sharp individual, this poorly lit restaurant gives him more than he bargained for. Hey, honey. Can you help me pick out a wire? The type is so small, and the lighting here is just horrible. Oh. Oh, it's no, 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 The no, font's no, so no, small, no, I can't no, read it. No. Oh. Oh, uh. Um, maybe a Merlot? No. I'll grab some water. You smell some smoke? Where? This, oh, this, oh. oh. These innocent patrons, seeking nothing more than dinner and conversation, have unknowingly entered the Presbyopia Zone. I'm coming! I'm coming! Oh! I think we're ready for the check now. Well, many of us at a certain age suffer from what we call short arm syndrome. Your arms simply aren't long enough to read up close anymore. Yeah. You know it. Yeah, the FDA just approved a permanent solution to the blurry vision problem. Channel 4's Tracy Cornett has more in today's Healthy for Life. Tracy? Well, yes. As we age, the eye muscles that control our ability to focus start to weaken. We look them like this, right? The medical term for this is presbyopia. And after 10 years of research and clinical trials, the FDA just approved a first of its kind procedure to help aging eyes over 40 see again and a Nashville surgeon is one of the first in the country to perform it. Kim Terrell of Brentwood couldn't believe her eyes when she spotted an ad on social media. It claimed to cure an increasingly annoying ailment the Belmont professor has been battling the last few years. I'm getting tired of chasing around 10 or 12 different pairs of readers. I can't even see my food now. But my plate is blurry. I can't fathom what I'm going to be at in another 10 years. The 50-year-old wife and mother called, researched, and within days scheduled an appointment for 3D laser camera surgery with Nashville eye surgeon Dr. Ming Wang. We're the only center in Tennessee offering that. And um, we did the first one on June 9th. I did 11 patients. Just approved in April by the FDA, camera involves implanting a tiny plastic ring into the cornea in one eye only. The pinhole effect forces light to enter the eye in a narrow beam, which increases both focus and range of vision. This was a ring that, because it doesn't affect the muscle, it will give you 
an, another way to get up close vision without having to rely on the muscle. Patients must be 45 and older and have good distance vision or have had LASIK surgery to make them that way. During the 10 minute procedure, patients feel pressure but no pain and the results are almost instant. Congratulations. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> this is an excellent beginning. Now, the most common side effects of 3D laser camera surgery include dry eye, halos, night vision disturbances, but studies show they gradually resolve over time. 3D laser camera surgery is reversible. It costs about $6,000. For information, go to WSMV.com and click on Healthy for Life.